Hello everybody. In this video I'm going to teach you how to upgrade the firmware of your ASUS RT-AX82U router and also how to enable automatic update so that you don't have to worry about it and let it update in the background. So let's get started. The first thing you need to do obviously is to uh, enter your password using my password to log in. Once you're logged in, you have to go to firmware version, click on this right here. Once you click on here, right here is where you, you check this box to make the auto firmware upgrade enabled. Currently it's off. I would like to keep it off because I don't want it to uh, automatically update and cause problems. This is where you check for updates. If there is an update, you check on this, update will appear here, and then you will click on it. This is where you upgrade to an older version or upgrade uh, the firmware to uh, the version you have, un uh, you have loaded and saved in your computer. So first, I'm going to check to see if there is an update. So right now, it's searching for an update. There is an update available, and if I want to upgrade, I will just click this. So currently I'm not going to click, but I'm just teaching you that this is where you would do it. If I were to update uh, from a file in my hard drive, an, an existing uh, version, then I click here on Upload. It's going to ask me where is the file, and I will point to where the file is, and I'll click Open, and it will update the firmware to the version of my choice. But this is the latest version, 3.0.0.4388.24.23.1. So whatever those numbers are, this is the, the, the latest that's available. And this is the version that I have. So this is the current version, and this is the latest version. So now I'm going to do the update in front of you so you can see what happens. Firmware upgrade. So right now, it's downloading the firmware that it needs to upgrade. So give it a good, you know, minute or two. It's, uh, I'm going to fast forward the video so that I don't make you wait. And I will tell you how long it took. Okay, so it reached 100%, but it took very, very long time. It, it, it wasn't three minutes. It was more than that. Maybe my internet was slow, I don't know. So after the update, the unit kind of uh, asked me to log in again. So the login information was... Uh, so right now, uh, the, the firmware is up to date. Here are the, up, the latest, the current version. Mine is the current version. Everything looks good, but if if I want to install and try the, the, uh, the beta version, the beta is like the trial version, the version that hasn't been proven. It could be full of bugs, full of problems. So I'm not going to check the box. But if I wanted to, I could check the box and check the beta and download the beta and use it. But for now, I'm happy with this, so I'll leave it as it is. All right. Okay. I hope this was educational and you learn how to update your firmware in your browser. If there's any questions, please write in the comments and I'll be more than happy to help. Thank you.